yes let's make sure you click oh oh yes and then you oh, yes okay let's resume hi guys d sims here and welcome back to the channel and today i bring to you another decorating video today we are designing the nursery for the triplets for a san antonio and girl it is so freaking cute so this is the orientation i wanted the cribs just because if we need to well when we need to get to all three babies they're in close proximity there's not a lot of walking we need to do they're both they're all i shouldn't i can't even say both they're all just right there but i wanted to go for this like pastel i was trying to originally go for like a kawaii theme like very similar to sakari's first room when she was like a preteen i wanted to go back to that era just for a little bit of nostalgia for her and i felt like she was really comfortable uh decorating the nursery this way so that's what we really went for a really cutesy pastel and really went for this like sky theme um so like you'll see like clouds and moons and stars and butterflies on the walls and i just thought it was super adorable and kind of like sakari is kind of like feeling that vibe again which she once was very happy and colorful and like didn't have a care in the world everything was fine relationship with parents and siblings and friends was fine and she was just very happy and bubbly and very much into her k-pop era honey and just living life and she's kind of getting back there you know like she's really happy and i feel like that's kind of like her happy place so the kawaii and the pastel feel definitely is sakari's happy place so um, that's what we decided to do, to do the nursery in. And I know Antonio just wants his little girls to be like his little princesses. You know, he's kind of really grown to, you know, he is the man of the house and he's really like been taking on that role, just being protective and, you know, uh, providing for them and just coming in clutch when it comes to his little family. So definitely wanted, you know, Sakari to have whatever she wants, as long as the baby have the babies have everything that they need. He really didn't have an issue with it. So I wanted Sakari to be in the room. So it's kind of like she's putting this all together or like, you know, she's like designing everything and placing kind of like nesting in the, in a sense, like she is really, um, wanting to get everything in order because the next time we play, I believe Sakari will be going into labor. So my goal for the next episode is to have Sarabi come over and kind of like prepare them some food and just some things that they can um, have. They don't have to worry about cooking and stuff like that. Like, um, so Robbie's gonna come over and maybe bring them some groceries and just kind of nest and get everything together. You know, clean up everything, dust, vacuum, make sure everything is just perfect for the babies. And just like some really, really, really cute stuff. We wanna like d use the little, um, I, I I call it, it, it's definitely an oil diffuser, but I kind of use it as like an air purifier, <laughs> like where they can come over and like clean the room and just make sure everything is just in order because it is going to be very hellish <laughs> when Sakari gives birth. But this set that you see right now is by SYB. I absolutely love SYB's uh, CC and they sent it to me early to test and I'm so excited. Thank you so much for sending this closet cc kit i believe um it will be out or if it's not public yet it will be out very very soon i will leave all of that in the comments down below so if you're looking for this closet kit it is very cute very like ikea-esque with the little built-ins and there's baskets and you know you can hang up your clothes and everything i actually use this little cube that comes with it as a changing table there was a changing table that came with this with the crib set but it wasn't really fitting the theme that I want. It wasn't, it, I wanted a little bit more built in look. So we went with this uh, closet kit and I added that little pillow seating to look like, um, like the changing pad. So yes, I know a lot of people thought, well, we originally talked about Sakari waiting. She's pretty much going to be the guinea pig for the infant update and everything like that. But you know, with that being so far out, it would have been torture. It would have been so mean for us to keep her pregnant for that long. So yes, yeah, she is having the babies. Now I don't know, I don't know how long the babies are gonna be babies. Um, my rule, I try to keep them babies for at least two episodes. 
because it's really nothing to do like you can't really do anything for babies but because we really want this to be that realistic feel maybe we'll keep them babies for a little bit longer where they're kind of like tied to the house they're pretty much doing all of the they're pretty much doing all of the um baby stuff like 24 7. they're both working from home so you know we kind of want it to be a little bit realistic with that scent um and then there's actually a party event uh called meet the baby so we can like invite family and friends over to meet the baby and every the babies i gotta stop saying baby um to meet the babies and stuff like that i thought that would be really really cute so i want to kind of keep them babies for a little bit longer than what i normally do just so they can feel that true uh triplet terror because when they become toddlers lord and we got a puppy the puppy already been peeing in the house and trying to bite on stuff like look we got a puppy i don't know what antonio was thinking with this puppy but we have a puppy and we're about to have three babies it's going to be crazy so robbie's gonna come over the next episode she's gonna help us get the house in order kind of give her some tips and stuff and um i'm thinking we may even have um her and why i know when the when the kids become triplets when the babies become triplets i want wyatt to come like to stay with them for a while so he can help out um maybe even when they're babies but i thought it would be really good if her mom was there but i don't know how antonio feels about sarabi so maybe we'll just have wyatt come over and he can help but what is wyatt going to do girl i don't know but it would be nice to have somebody kind of stay with them for a few episodes to kind of help them out and stuff but i do think the the first couple of days with the baby triplet we need to let them feel that pain because they're like oh yeah you know we're just gonna be fine i'm gonna be streaming when i want and going out when i want and just buying chipotle whenever we feel like it girl no 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 but i'm really excited for growing together this you know it's been really hard to record knowing that growing together is coming out soon because i just really want that in my game right now like i just want that pack so bad so bad like even with my rags to riches but we're parent series they're planning on having another baby like i'm just so ready for it but in the comments down below i have a big question should we use an existing family or previous family anybody who was previously in an lp should we use them for our growing together series or should we create entirely new people and start their journey like i wanted to do a series called growing together with blank like growing together with the johnsons or something like that i thought that would be super super cute and we can kind of you know build up their family or something like that or should we use an existing lp family maybe somebody from back in the day maybe somebody from a family that we didn't really focus on like a specific sim we didn't focus on comment down below what you're thinking because i am like stumped when i tell you i really 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 want to just play i don't know i i i, I can go either way but i really do feel like a new family with like a new house would be so good but i don't know i do plan on making a family like a suburban family house when we read the article and everything about the new pack growing together it is craftsman style so i was gonna make a new craftsman style family home and i was gonna do it on a 40 by 30 a lot i'm hoping that the new world has a 40 by 30 in it because i feel like that big tree house is really really big so you're gonna want like a decent sized backyard for it so um that's gonna be one of my goals for february is to get that house together or even early early march to get that house together um for that i will be putting out my rags to riches but we're parents house which kind of has more of like a beachy style uh to it but it can definitely be converted into like a little suburban house if that's what you're looking for so yes um with the nursery back to the nursery we are definitely doing our purple blues and pinks um, I feel like that was kind of like Sakari's room color. I think Sakari's room was a little bit more pinky. I don't know. She had a lot of colors in there, but we wanted it to feel familiar with everything that Sakari, you know, her old little K-pop room and how that was. We definitely want, she wanted something, you know, 
that felt good, that felt relatable, familiar. And I think this was a cute little addition. One thing I love to do in kids' rooms is just like put plushies down on the floor. Like they having like a little, um, like a little meeting or a little gathering or something. Because when I was growing up, I used to put all my plushies and doll babies, like they would sit like in that little, like how you see right there, like in a little arc. Like if we was having a meeting, I used to play school a lot with my um, stuffed animals. So they would be in school and then I would have like a, a old phone. It, sometimes it was a play phone. Sometimes it was just like an old cord phone that didn't work anymore. And I'll be like, uh-uh, you being bad, I'm calling your mama. And I would pretend I'm calling. <laughs> So if you ever see me put like little stuffed animals on the floor like that, just know, just because, you know, just because. But I really loved how this um nursery came together. So freaking cute. We did end up using that rug that was previously here. So we used that and I think we used the lamp. Yes, that lamp was previously here. And I just went around and tried to find as much uh, stars and moons and clouds that I could find in my game and just put them all around. And it just came out really, really adorable. Like I really loved everything and I'm just excited to play in this room. Really wish babies had more to do than to just sit in their crib and cry poop and eat. <laughs> it would have been so nice if this was the infant update. Ugh, I just wish we can fast forward to March and get the update, cause I want it. I want it now. But I'm gonna hush. I'm gonna let y'all go ahead and enjoy the rest of this um, speed build. Let me know in the comments down below about what we should do for growing together because I'm stumped. I've been thinking about it since it was announced. I don't know what to freaking do, but I do know we're gonna have a whole bunch of family, everything on there from newborn to elder. And I'm even gonna let, I'm even gonna play with agent on and I'm gonna let my, my Sims pass away. <laughs> I'm gonna do it because it's part of it. And I'm just, it's gonna be good, y'all. I'm excited. Let me know what you think. I will see you guys in a, uh, wait, I was about to say, I'll see y'all in the comments down below. Ciao, I will see y'all in the next one. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. Remember to stay beautiful, stay lovely, stay in the house, and have a grand, grand day. Bye, guys. Be honest, you you think I get my nine. It's dishonest to say that I've been feeling a line and out of ya. Staying up and out of the chance and nigga Peter up the go could shine in on cause you mind. Now I'm sprung, running through my head, knee up here, my dad draw. She got up the go hard, think I gotta go. You ain't even gotta tell me twice. So you fancy, funny how you win my life. Good day, he jam, Kungu Majiana, who do you mean that? Think about her strip down on the east ace. Driving on the wrong side down on the freeway. Frequent trips and frequent knee key day. Judy cut on, John, John, doll, he made your dog. Think about the brothers all John John Kojo Tingles high it all I know I told you we could be there One, two, three I ain't never planned it that you left like that Like that It's a meal rule is out and then Staying up at night it's a boy we get Yeah I don't really miss you True Talking like we're friends oh she not talking Like a game but you not even play Yo like how you might hit a boy young I don't really need you yeah. All I need is you She can't see that door, but can't go up. Go all the time, wondering if what you said is even true. How can you know how to go? He ain't had to go. I think I should have said no. Said I understood. Me and Hajima, Jingles high, those high, talking how to go. Mama told her to go. Sorry if I let you on. Switch up. I see you rocking new hair and less makeup. Mogi told you, Marty, so get taker. Sing on my neck, I could break her. Sing on my neck, I wake up with Hajima. How can she sing again? Ah, how you just cruising on by? I'm busy doing a lot, getting you. Out of my mind, getting you. I ain't never telling that you left like that. Like that. It's a meal, but it's out and then. Staying up at night, it's a boy we get. Yeah. I don't really miss you. True. Talking like we're friends, OG and I talk it. Like a game, but you not even play. Not You're like Kajima, he the boy Jianke. I don't really need you. All I need is you.
Yeah, I'll be honest. Yo, you need to get my name. It's the sun. Just say that I've been feeling alone. And I need ya. Staying up and out of the chance. And you got Peter up the goku chan in uncle Jim. Now I'm strong. When it do my head, you'll pay my day. She got up the go hard. Think I gotta go. You ain't even gotta tell me twice. So you fancy. Funny how you win my life. Good day, he jang. Kungu Majiana, who do you mean? Think about her strip down on the east side. Driving on the wrong side down on the freeway. Frequent trips and frequent need. Key day. Who you cut down? John, John, Dog. Hit me, dude. Think about the brothers all. John, John, Cause y'all. Tingles high it all. I know I told you we could be there. One, two, three. I ain't never been there. You left like that. Like that. It's a million rookies out there. Staying up at night is a boy we get yeah. I don't really miss you True. Talking like we're friends, OG and I talk it Like a game But you not even play Yo la kaji ma, he don't boji yanke I don't really need you yeah. All I need is you Yeah, All I need is you All I need is you Yeah, like all I need is you Baby, we can rendezvous Baby, all I need is you Like all I need is you She got gin, I don't pack it, I'm gonna go all the time. Wondering if what you said is yeah. even true. How can you know how to go? He ain't had to go, I think I should have said no. no. Said I understood me and Hajima. Yeah. Jingles, high doors, high choke, how to go. Yeah. Mama told God to go. Sorry if I let you on. Yeah. Switch up, I see you rocking new hair and let's make up. Make up. Jogi, Jogi, Marty, so get take up. Sing up my neto, could break up. Sing up my neto, I wake up with Hajima. How can she sing again now? How you just cruising on by? Yeah. I'm busy doing a lot, getting you out of my mind, getting you out I of my mind. I ain't even telling that you left like that. Like that. It's a million movies out there.